The societal costs of enlisting women into national service now would far outweigh the benefits. Women will be delayed into their entry into the workforce. The immediate effect will be an accentuated decline in the size of our local workforce and a reduction of household incomes. Even if women are enlisted for non-military national service roles to augment our health care and social services, it may make manpower shortages in other industries worse. Over the long term, it will impose a great cost, not only on women themselves, but also on their families, children and spouses, and society as a whole. Is that cost justified to send a signal or to reverse stereotypes? From the government's perspective, no. I think most Singaporeans would say no too, from a security perspective. But if Singapore is ever threatened with an existential threat by an aggressor, and have a sudden and great need to boost our military, I am certain that MINDEF and the SAF would call on the government of that day to enlist not only women, but even teenagers and older men into military service to defend and save Singapore. 